Warte. Look at that, it's quite a big one. I'm just going to put my hand next to it. I actually want to move it along a little bit. There we go, it's coming out again. Give an idea. Just as a size comparison, quite a large praying mantis and you can see beautifully camouflaged to blend in amongst the leaves. And also the way it's moving, you can see it's sort of rocking back and forth almost. That's just to mimic the movement of the leaf and the slight breeze that there's out there. So giving it extra camouflage. Of course that camouflage having two benefits. One is that it's not as likely to get eaten by something. This would be a perfect meal for something like a hornbill or a uh, bee eater, uh, maybe a big bee eater. Let's rather say a, a woodland kingfish would be able to go for this. But a hornbill would love this. Quite a few birds that would like to eat this. So it needs to be hidden from them. But of course also for it to catch its own food praying mantises eat a lot of other insects and so on it needs to be very well camouflaged as well isn't that incredible Look, even the legs and part of the body abdomen everything looks like leaves Very cool insect, Alex. Amazing, huh? Now again, you get many, many different species of praying mantises, the same as you, um, praying mantids, you can say it as well. Same as you do with beetles and other bugs, many, many different species. And in this area alone, probably a couple of hundred. I wouldn't be surprised if there was a couple of hundred species just in, in the low felt. You get these ones that are just perfectly camouflaged. You also get ones that look like dead leaves. And then of course you get the stick insects, which are not the same as this, but similar. They look a bit more like dead sticks or like grass blades. The camouflage of the insects out here. So many insect species we will almost never see just because they blend in so well. That's quite cool. I enjoyed seeing this one. Have another look because you can now see it a bit more from the top sort of we were looking at it from the underbelly let's get a bit of a different side view of it very very healthy praying mantis as well see that abdomen is nice and thick means it's been eating plenty obviously a good hunter this one Yeah, no, that's very, very nice. Haley also saying just from that side, the control room, she loves praying mantises. Praying mantids. Not quite sure if both of those are correct, but she absolutely loves these. And this is truly a beautiful, beautiful specimen. Very healthy and just cool to see. Might be another few months before we can spot one like this, or maybe a year or two. See how it's still moving like that, just that slow sort of rocking motion, making the movements of a leaf in the wind. Fantastic. Certainly a little highlight for me this morning seeing this guy.